we're going to do some showcase some youth guns tonight for the bird hunter and rabbit hunter in your family. We've got the little uh, Mossberg uh, Mini 410. We call this the Mighty Mouse. This is a, a, a six shot 410. Of course, it's plugged for hunting. Now, this gun comes with spacers on the stock. There's one spacer in here now. Uh, you, and there's two more spacers in the box. As your child grows into it, you can, you can add length to it. Or later on, you can just buy the 410 stock, it's the adult stock, and it'll bolt right on here. This is a great little gun for a kid. This will be a good gun for a woman for home defense. You put shot shells or buckshot in here, and you got a short gun that you can handle. Yeah, that's a, that's a great gun they can grow into. Right. Now, if your kid's a little bit, a little bit stouter, you get the same gun in a 20 gauge. 20 gauge gun, same deal. This is with a stock at its shortest setting, very short. Like I said, you get three more spacers with it, so you can space it out as they get older. But this is the 20 gauge. This would make an excellent home defense gun for a woman or some on a small stature. Uh, this gun will also shoot three inch shells, which would be hard to handle with for a child. Moving on down here, we've got uh, some of you guys that have the Thompson Center Encore. They just came out with this one. It's a scaled down version of the Encore. It's just like the adult gun, except it's a 22. Beautiful little gun. This gun probably doesn't weigh three pounds. It's easy to cock. It's easy to manipulate. It opens very easily. Yep, and the nice thing about that gun, Barry, is that, you know, of course, if Daddy has the big version, it's real easy for Junior to, you know, get the hang of it from, into the big one later, yeah, from yes. watching his dad use the big one. Now, this is 22 LR, but it will shoot all 22s, uh, the short, long, long rifle, CB cap, so on and so forth. It comes in a green camo. Or you can get the same gun in a black, basic black. Well, or if you've got a little girl in the family, they make this same gun with a pink camo. We don't have one of those to show you, but it's a pretty little gun. That's a little TC. It's called a hot shot. This is a Cricket 22. These things have been around for years and years and years. Now, we don't have one in a plain wood stock, but we've got this blue laminate. Now, the, about this gun, it is key locked. These little keys, if you're out in the field somewhere and you do that, your gun is locked up. You have to have the key to undo it. So this could accidentally get pushed up. So if you buy one of these, be sure to keep these in your pocket because your kid's damn sure going to push that up on something. we got the same little gun with this double blue laminate. Same gun, same deal, got the same lock. But you have to be careful with this lock here because it'll, it'll lock them out of the gun. We've got the little single shot, Rossi. This happens to be a 17 HMR, but this comes in 22 long rifle, and you can get one called a trifecta that has three barrels. You get a 22 long rifle barrel, a 20 gauge barrel, and a 243 barrel. So they can hunt everything from, from groundhogs to deer with it. Savage makes this nice little gun here. It's pink laminate. Uh, it has an AccuTrigger. That makes the action very, when you lock it down, that makes the action very, very delicate. This is probably the ultimate kid gun. This is made by CZ. It comes in uh, pink and it comes in uh, walnut wood too. This gun is, uh, is not cheap, but it's, this is an adult type 22. It's got a uh, nice positive safety on it. Like I said, it comes in, uh, it comes in wood too. Uh, we refer to this as the Goodbye Kitty Edition. That's a great gun. We've got the little Henry. This is the gun that's been around for many, many years. When you load this gun, you have to pull the striker back to cock it. Yeah, just like the Davy Cricket. And then you've got, uh, you've got a safety on it. Now this gun, I shot this target with this gun at 50 feet. Super Calibri rounds, that small of a group shooting offhand at 50 feet. Now, these rounds are Calibri rounds. They have no powder in them. It's primer compound only. But these, uh, these Super Calibris are 500 feet a second. So you're hitting as hard as the strongest pellet gun, and this will kill a squirrel instantly. These are very, very nice for squirrel hunting. 
From this rifle, the sound of that bullet hitting this wood was louder than the gun discharging. You can literally shoot these in your backyard and your neighbor will never hear it. This is a good thing to have here. This gun is a Savage single shot youth gun. Uh, it has a seven shot magazine. Accu-trigger, again, positive safety. This, this is a nice little gun here. Uh, later on, you can get a stock that fits this model Savage that's longer. Barry, one thing that I want to mention too, I've shot that rifle and those little guns are extremely accurate. I mean, very easy to shoot, very good trigger, very usable sights. I recommend that gun to anybody. It's, it's Not just a child, anybody. It's a wonderful little gun. Good little backpacking rifle, whatever. We've got the same gun with a lighter weight, smaller walnut stock. Accu trigger again. This one has a peep sight, well that one has a blade sight. This is a wonderful gun for a kid. This is a single shot. It's got a one little loading tray. Drop them in there one at a time. Positive safety and active trigger. Great little gun. When your child gets old enough to handle a semi-automatic, this is a Ruger 1022 youth model. It has uh, fiber optic sights. It has a uh, quick release mag right here, 10 shot. Now Ruger just came out with a BX25 magazine. This is an actual Ruger product that holds 25 rounds. It go right in your 1022. And they work beautifully. And they work beautifully. Now if you've got a little girl in the family, the same gun comes in a pink, a pink laminate, same gun, take the same magazine. Ruger 1022. What are you swearing on? It's always a good idea to get your youngster involved in shooting at a young age. And a lot of these little guns that we showed you are a great way to accomplish that. And especially without breaking the budget. Um, in terms of cost, a lot of the guns that we showed you can be had for around two bills, give or take, depending on the model. Some of the models, like uh, the Savage that I'm holding, these uh, little cubs can run probably, what, around three? 179. 179? 179. Okay. So in terms of cost, you can really get your youngster into shooting for a uh, minimal investment, and you'll find that in the long run, that investment will really pay off with your kids enjoying themselves out on the range and just, you know, you're creating more, more gun enthusiasts and more sportsmen, and overall, that's really what our country needs is more people interested in guns. So really a uh, great way to get your kid into shooting and hunting for not a lot of money. That's correct. I want to mention also while we're on camera here, when we were talking about the Keystone Arms Davy Cricket model, I do have a video on there, you'll have to look it up, of uh, me ringing a 12 inch bullet trap at about 250 yards with one of these. So the guns are capable of very good feats of accuracy. So if you uh, are going to buy one of these for your kid, maybe let him check out that video so he uh, you know, can yeah. see just how accurate the oh, yeah. guns can really be. I also have a full review of the Davy Cricket separate video if you guys want to see that. And a uh, great way to get your kids involved in shooting. That's mm -hmm. correct. you got to get them involved early, though. Yep. you got about 8 or 10 years old is ideal to start off a child. Absolutely. You want to pique their interest early. So with this being around the holiday season, we thought this would be a good video for you guys to maybe glean a little info as to what's out there and maybe... Uh, pick up a new smoke pole for Junior. That's correct. <laughs>